So the Fluid Power Challenge that we host here in Franklin is put on through the National Fluid Power Association in Milwaukee, and it's designed for seventh and eighth grade students and allows them to build models out of wooden pieces, kits, glue, to perform a certain task. So today, we're fortunate to have up to 24 teams with us, and all these teams are within a 70 mile radius of Franklin. And we're so fortunate and lucky that this many kids wanted to be involved in a STEM-related function that, you know, got them out of school, but also gave them the opportunity to really play with some new tools, develop those design skills, and work outside the box in order to create a fluid power machine. Overall, we're really fortunate to have the sponsorship that we receive in order to make this happen. Uh, today, we're very fortunate to have our sponsors, our guests, as well up to 30 volunteers from our Komatsu location in order to kind of help us assist with putting on this entire event. I think the best part for me is I obviously seeing the kids and how excited they are. They're very passionate about what they do and they get really excited for this competition. But a big part I've noticed is the sponsors will come in and they'll drop their schedules to make sure that they can be here because it's exciting for them and it's different. It's cool to see what they do day in and day out being applied and how excited kids are at such a young age to take the components and actually apply, you know, syringes and small tools, but see how it's applicable for larger and, and bigger scaled items. The Fluid Power Challenge, I feel, is very important to the community to bring young students from the different schools around the area into one place, to see them use their imaginations and uh, really problem solve and brainstorm as a team. Teams come at the end of March, we give them instructions, we give them tools, we give them a kit of materials, we give them some pre-cut kits for a rotating platform and a lifting platform and allows them to get a feel for building wooden models. Having a child involved here, it's a great opportunity for him to be exposed to a career path or a potential career path that he might not get exposed to in a normal school setting. So that's been a great opportunity for him to experience such a thing. This is my third year volunteering at the Fluid Power Challenge. I always enjoy watching the kids come in on day one, seeing how they work together, exiting, and then when they come back on challenge day, um, how their minds work, how they solve the challenges um, to compete. 